Why the fuck is this happening? God damn it. Hey, what? <clears throat> hey, what's up guys? So I hope you guys are having a good Monday. This is my second attempt at filming this video because my focusing was out. So hopefully this is a little bit better. Okay. So the the nurse, there was a nurse in Japan who was suspected of killing up to 20 patients. And they found this out by, they, they noticed one of the other nurses on shift noticed that there were bubbles in the IV tubing uh, coming to one of the patients. Well, they ended up testing that because of the bubbles and, the, and it come to find out that it was a disinfectant that they noticed and they, and they did a big investigation uh, followed this other nurse around and it finally came out somehow that she was actually poisoning uh, patients and up to 20 patients that they know of that she poisoned and when they finally uh, questioned her about it and I guess she admitted to it she said that um, she just didn't want to have the uh, she wanted these people to die uh, after her shift was over uh, because she didn't want to have to tell the families that uh, about the death you know it, it, I guess it that's that's her that's her version of it who really knows but you know uh, but I bring this point up guys I bring this up because I want you guys to understand that as nurses it is your responsibility to police your own people if you suspect somebody's doing drugs if you suspect that somebody's hurting patients if you suspect that if they're stealing nar narcotics whatever you're doing that is your responsibility to uh, to report them, report them nurses. I know it's easy to, uh, you know, to, uh, it's not really easy for me, but I know some people say they don't want to, you know, turn in other fellow nurses or whatever, but you know, that's, that's garbage. We in the nursing profession, uh, are the same as the, uh, as physicians and, and anybody else is the first thing is you do not do any harm. That's the first rule of, uh, of medicine. So guys, one of the things too, about being a a good nurse or being a uh you know about the nursing profession in general is that we police our own um we hold our stand we have our standards up here and we sit when we expect every other nurse to uh to be to raise their standards as well and to you know we just need to police our own um it's one of the great things about nursing that I like, you know, unlike with like police officers and some other where they will, they will hide facts or try to cover up things, at least nurses and for the most part in the medical profession will, uh, will, will make sure that their counterparts are living up to those standards of, uh, that we expect as nurses. Now, um, when I was reading about this, it's not uncommon to see these, these things, these little tidbits in the news. There was a uh, nurse in Germany back in uh back in january who had a i think she had like 98 deaths on her uh ended up being uh convicted of that and that's you know that's uh that's very uh that's scary when you think about it because as nurses we have so much autonomy as far as like starting doing meds um uh power passing meds uh making sure these patients are taken care of so we have a lot of responsibility on our hands and a lot of autonomy at times you know the physicians can't be the, be in there watching us at all times our fellow nurses can't be in there watching us at all time at all times so i say this guys as a kind of a reminder you know uh always you know always in the peripherals keep your you know keep your fellow co-workers in your uh you know in your vision or in your mind because you don't ever know you know pay attention for little cues they said that they uh this Japanese nurse, they, that she was hard to figure out, but overall she was considered a competent nurse. Uh, you know, so that's kind of a tricky situation. However, you know, I still believe I'm a big believer in that if you if there if there's something in your gut telling you that something isn't right with this person, you know, keep your eyes open. Don't let it don't let it get past you. Uh, don't let it, you know, don't don't settle in for complacency and and get and just you know just pay attention to what is going on pay, pay attention to your surroundings that's the biggest thing i could say um, because we don't want people like this representing uh nursing it goes against everything that we stand for um if you're if you're hurting patients uh if you're abusing drugs if you're putting your uh your patients lives at risk uh if you're putting your fellow co-workers at risk you know um okay guys that's it i just thought it was a pretty interesting piece of news today that i forgot to talk about last week. All right, guys, you guys have a good Monday. Peace out.